Hi, welcome to CTN Member Highlights. I'm Leslie McVeigh, and today my guests are from the English Language Program at Learning Works. I have Juan Alemon and Martin Kiliwa. Kiweyo. Kiweyo. Mm -hmm. Welcome. Now, Martin, you've been in the English Language Program for a little while at Learning Works, but mm -hmm. you are a current student, mm -hmm. and you're here from. Sudan, mm -hmm. South Sudan. Yeah. And tell me how you got involved in the program at Learning Works and what it has meant to you. Uh, actually, I involved in the uh, Learning Works program uh, because I came from my original country. Uh, of course, this is my my second country also. So the important for me to learn English is very important because the country itself, it is uh, English speakers. Right. So for me to communicate with the people for daily ac activity, I have to learn English. Yeah. And that's difficult as an adult, isn't it? And not, did you have any English at all before you came here? Uh, before I came here, my English was very limited mm -hmm. because my country, it is English speakers. Oh. Because it's colonized by English people. Mm -hmm. But I learned, but the most English I learned, I learned here. Oh. Yeah, in adult education. Uh -huh. Because I was in adult education before, and then I registered in uh, learning works. Continue I, with yeah, it. program. Yeah. yeah. And Juan, you are from El Salvador. Exactly. And you haven't been here very long. I have been here for, I think, for four years. Four years. years. But your children have just recently yes, come yes, over. Yes, yes, they came one year. Next, I mean, last year. Uh-huh. Yeah. And you have two children. Two children. Just come over. Two daughters. So now the three of you are all learning English. Yes. Yeah. And yes. how... How did you find the program at Learning Works? Well, uh, my my brother-in-law uh, he recommend to that place Learning Works, mm -hmm. and this is in interesting for me. Yeah, because I before when I came here, I I doesn't speak English nothing, but right now and that must have been kind of scary to come to a place where most of the, mo everybody speaks English and yeah. you must have felt a little isolated. Yeah. But, yeah. yeah. So y you're all in class together. It doesn't matter what country you come from. You're not divided into groups of Spanish or speakers or um, French speakers or wh Hausa speakers or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, so how is that communicating not only with trying to learn English, but communicating with each other, speaking different languages. Yeah, inside in the classroom, just English. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's the rule. That's the rule, yeah. English immersion, right? Yeah, English, exactly. But when you talk with each other, you probably are facing the same hurdles and frustrations as well as the same successes. So. Um, Tell, tell me a little bit about, Martin, maybe you want to say a little bit about the class. You've been in it a little bit longer than I, one. I, yeah. You see, when we, because, I, of course, as I said earlier, that uh, we are different uh, groups, different countries, mm -hmm. and different languages. But when we came together and at his school, uh, it's only one language is formed as a bring us in board together mm -hmm. as English. That's because everyone has, has his own language. Uh, for example, like me, I speak like four languages. But ah. when we came together, we speak only English. And that gives you your own little community of, of new English speakers. Exactly. Now, you both have children in the schools here, and they are having to learn the language, the English language. When you're all at home with your children, do you sit around and speak English now at home? Yeah, actually for myself, uh, I, when 
at home, I usually like to speak English because my kids, they speak very, very good English because I speak in American English. Mm -hmm. Because two, they're born here, and then I came with the one, those that are youngest. Mm -hmm. uh, so the one I came with him, his boy, he catch English very fast because when he came, he was less than a year. He was like nine months. Oh, that's a good so age. When, yeah, yeah. yeah, good age too. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I like to speak with them English because I need to learn from them. Yeah. Yeah. And what about you, Juan? Are you trying to speak English at home with at your home, children? At home, yes. Yes, because this is help for us. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. And are there other Spanish speakers, your brother-in-law? No, my um, wife. Yeah. My wife, yeah, we live in my wife, my two daughters. And I and we try to speak just English. Now at, Lear at the English language program at Learning Works, it's not just about learning the language, but you also learn how to take that language and use it in the community. Is that not correct? Yeah, it's correct. It's so correct. you go out and learn how to communicate in the grocery store and other places that you might interact with people is that, that's right. right that's right and how have you found that um fun as well as challenging or uh it's not really challenging because uh soon as you speak with the people you communicate with the people always in daily basis for example like in the stores or at work so this way you get english very fast and yeah. uh, it helps you to how to, as I say, to how to communicate with people, or how to, 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 to find your way around the, exactly, the, the yeah. community. Yeah. Now, what would you recommend the program to other people coming in to, to yes, Portland area? Yes, who, yes, yes. Yeah. I recommend a, a lot of uh, friends to attend that uh, program. It's very interesting, and this way you can learn English fast. Yeah. Yeah, it's a very good program. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then uh, also our new come out, those people that came newly, we also recommend them to, to attend the program. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And what about you, Paul? Well, the same, same yeah. too. I recommend yeah. that place and everything is free. Yeah. Yeah, it's amazing. It's wonderful. Yeah. And do you One, go every day? Or? Uh, four days a week. Oh, yeah. so, so the repetition, yeah, repetition. and the... Yeah. And also you. I'm going to add... Well, regarding that program. There's uh, the difference between that program and adult education, because when I was in adult education, uh, I didn't involve in computer program, but here uh. I used to take a computer school and uh, classes, uh -huh. and it helps me a lot. So now I can do a lot of things in computer, I can send email, yeah. I can do it. Uh, yeah. It's amazing. And then, yeah. Well, if people want to find out more about this, they can go to the Learning Works um, website which we will run on here and Paul Manoff is the director of the programming there they can talk with him and I'm sure if people want to volunteer to come in and help they can as well yes all right yes. well thank you both for being here no, thank I you. think your English is wonderful both of you <laughs> thank you, you know, I understood everything <laughs> hope you understood me <laughs> thank you so thank much you. thank you very much yeah, thank you very much yeah.